Loading calculates on a page can be easy and fun with the Dividend On Demand plugin that you can find on our website under Divi Plugins page. You can download this plugin for free. Just click the download button and you can directly download this plugin by clicking this link here or you can subscribe and add your email address and in the same time subscribe and download. The choice is all yours. Once you have downloaded this plugin, install it and activate it. Then go to settings and you will see dividend on demand option that will take you to this dashboard. And on your left you are going to see the filters options and on your right all our layouts and modules. You want to select new collections, Coco collection to filter only Coco layouts here. And very important. It, you need to have the Coco bundle activated and also API key activated for the Coco too in order to use Dividend On Demand. And let me now demonstrate you how this works. You can search the layouts and modules using the search box. You can for example type fresh header. This will bring Coco fresh header module. You can type only header and this is going to filter only header modules. Uh, you can use all these filter options here. You can filter the modules and layouts by the page type, category. If you're searching for the modules only, you can do that by the module type. And uh, it's really easy to find what you're looking for. And once you do that, all you have to do is to click the save button. Once you do that, that very layout is going to be saved to your library, so you can now use it on a page. Go to page here, click load layout, and this layout that you just saved should be in the your saved layouts tab. But also you should notice here uh, that you have dividend on demand tab here as well, and it's the very same interface as in the plugin dashboard. Have in mind that there are two options here, load layout and add from library. Load layout is used when you want to save and load complete page layouts and if you're working with individual modules and sections, use add from library option. It may sometimes happen that instead of the save button you see something else such as the try for free button. Uh, this could be happening due to a couple of reasons. First one is if you have the Coco bundle actually the Coco Assistant plugin deactivated or if you haven't activated the API key for it. So once again make sure that you have activated the Coco Assistant plugin. If you already do that but you still see uh, some other button here instead of save button, you can try a couple of things. First one is to disable uh, any caching plugins that you might have enabled. Also deactivate theme caching and another thing you, you might try is to right click between the layouts then this frame and reload frame. This usually uh, works the best. Also if you're using a child theme try switching to DV parent theme and check again. And that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.